a very warm welcome back to my channel thank you so so much for tuning in today i'm heading to umoja estate in nairobi where i'm going to be showing you a beautiful modern and newly constructed bed sitter house i'm actually crossing the footbridge um that connects buruburu and umoja you know at mtindua area and because i love the view i decided to start the vlog here <laughs> anyway this is part nine of the house hunting tour series in case you haven't watched part one to eight the links are in the description box down below you can watch the videos after this one of course mm -hmm. let's go ahead and get started all right guys now this is the apartment and the bed sitter is on sixth floor house number six d to be precise but as we're walking up the stairs notice how everything looks so new even the stairs that silvery shiny thingy which i don't know how to call it in english is still intact because this place was um officially opened for rental about three months ago so it's it's clearly newly constructed guys it's a newly constructed apartment we are here house number 6d and the first thing that hits my eyes is the ceiling area and the natural light um, and even the space guys this right here is a very spacious and modern bed sitter and the window is well positioned the lighting is just perfect everything in here is fresh you guys and by fresh i mean um very brand new nobody has ever lived here there's a uh, zero wear and tear everything looks clean and uh, fantastic now the natural light is a bit harsh as you can clearly see but with the help of a blinder that is not a problem at all and I really love the curtain rod and also guys notice the modern token machine on the wall. Now the kitchen area is my favorite part in this house. Look at the tiles and the cabinets, both the high level and low level cabinets plus drawers on the side guys. This right here is unique. The view from the kitchen area is not bad at all. Everything looks bright and airy. It's, it's, it's okay. And the other good thing about this apartment guys is the fact that there is running water 24 7 like water is not a problem at all at all i know places here in umoja um, that do have uh, water problems here that is not an issue as you can clearly see and it's very very clean water and it has some sort of dark marble sink top where you can work on like chop your tomatoes and such like stuff Low level cabinet with drawers on the right side and of course kawaida cabinets um, on the left side. So beautiful and I really love the tiles. It's a new apartment guys and nobody has lived here so the tiles are so clean. Next let's check out the wardrobe. Um, it's a good size for a bed sitter and that protruding slab um, around the wardrobe area is where you can like place your laundry basket and you know your dirty laundry and such like stuff. Let's open the wardrobe and check it out you guys. Oh wow, just wow. I love the finishing and I love the furnishing. Mm. <laughs> I don't know if it's because it's brand new, but the finishing and furnishing is so good you guys. Check this out. And it's so so spacious. Um you can store quite a number of uh, stuff here you guys, like your clothes and such like. Now let's check out the bathroom and as you can clearly see it's a combined bathroom situation which I think is a common thing nowadays because of course of space. Um, look at that. Um, it's a beautiful place. The shower is so new. Inbuilt um, tissue holder, inbuilt uh, soap area, a sink and a mirror. Just you know the common kawaii stuff in a toilet. And the toilet is the kind of push to flash toilet. Um, it's a modern toilet that has like two types of flashes, you know, the smaller one and the bigger one. But do you know why? Well, let me tell you guys, the larger button flashes around six to nine liters of water and the smaller button around three to four liters of water. So the larger one is like for solid waste, you know, when you poop and the smaller one is for liquid waste if you know you know <laughs> so i guess you learned something if you didn't know but yeah i love the fact that it's a modern toilet instant shower and this right here are the sockets 
went back to the kitchen area and noticed the tap guys it's a modern tap um, very nice i like such tabs and i love the tiles around the sink area quality stuff my people quality stuff an intact and brand new um, curtain rod on the main entrance. I love the painting on the wall. I love the wardrobe area, guys. I just love this bed sitter. This is one of the best I guess I've checked out lately. Now let me move back so that you can have a clearer view of, uh, or a clearer picture about how spacious this place is. And look at that guys, it's so spacious, perfect lighting, perfect painting. It has everything, like literally everything, but it's missing a tenant. <laughs> and I love the tiles on the floor too. And this is the balcony area. It's very clean and spacious. Um, those are some of the neighboring houses, 6B, 6A, and this is 6D, of course, like I said in the beginning of the video. Now, guys, in terms of rent, uh, this bed sitter goes for 10,000 Kenya shillings or 100 dollars per month hmm and honestly i think that this right here is worth it considering the location um the fact that it's a new house everything is intact um that is so worth it guys uh, let's go down so that i can show you how this place looks <laughs> By the way guys as i'm walking down i've just remembered that this is not the only um house that is vacant in this building um there are two bedroom houses that are vacant here because it's a new house there's another bed sitter which is um it's slightly unique that's why i decided to do a whole different video for it um a different one um and i'm gonna share it i guess on the next one or maybe soon um so there are very um i think around five six houses that are vacant in this building there are two or three two bedroom houses and of course two bed seaters one is this one that i've just shown you and of course the other one that i'll talk about on my next video hopefully <laughs> This right here is the ground floor, um, very clean, it's a very clean place, uh, that is the main gate for the apartment. Electric meters right here for like the whole building, all the houses in this apartment. Such a simple and beautiful place. Anyway guys, as much as I love this house, it's not my house, but it could be yours. All you have to do is inbox me on Instagram at Katedi Natural and Facebook at Katedi underscore naturals and I'll hook you up. Anyway guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, share and of course subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Let me know what you think about of course the video and about the house and I'm gonna leave you with this um, beautiful view <laughs> from the footbridge uh, that connects Umoja and Buruburu. I love the view um, and I love the blue plus um, the view of the vehicles you know down there. I mean, now that we are not traveling, uh, we have to enjoy the little things like these guys. This right here is fun. <laughs> anyway, let's remain positive and hope that this nightmare will be over soon. Um, stay safe and I will definitely catch you later on the next one. Bye-bye.